What's up guys, Beyond the Objective here and today I'm bringing you a team deathmatch on the map grid and today I want to speak about YouTube and what is my plans for YouTube. Hopefully you do enjoy the video and let's get it started by saying the main thing I want to get out of YouTube is partnership and the reason why I want to get partnership is for so much reasons so I'm going to try and cover them in this video and I'm also going to try and cover some more reasons and the first thing that I want partnership really is because I would love to make a living off YouTube that would be amazing uh, around a few months ago I didn't really want any money from YouTube but thinking about it it does really help you out not only helps me out but it also helps you out because you get to see more videos and stuff but because I'm out of school and I've got a girlfriend and I've got so much stuff in my mind and all that stuff it is pretty time consuming to record, commentate, render and upload a video every day so it does take up, it does take up at least 3-4 to four hours each day which is why I only upload every 2 days and also there's not really that much games but if I was able to make a living out of YouTube then I would seriously have as much time as possible which would, would be amazing and that would be definitely that would be unbelievable getting paid for what you love doing and most jobs are terrible uh, you, you have to do work that you don't want to do but if I was getting paid for YouTube I would want to do every second of that <laughs> and hopefully that can be achieved one time because really I've been making YouTube videos for three years and my first channel which was around two to three years ago that had 3,000 subs which at the time was definitely huge I had more subs than Axe Jaws by a little bit and it, I was close to a mission in my partnership, I was talking to Shore Wars I think at the time I'm not too sure if he was a community manager but he was talking to me and stuff and I did email him but then my channel got hacked, I lost all my videos, I got it back, then I got hacked again and I got it back but then because I got hacked twice my channel basically got deleted I had an active subs and stuff so I just left the channel the way it was then use it again and then it get hacked again even though I wasn't using it so I do have really bad luck when it comes to channels and my latest, uh, my latest channel before this which was today's that had 1200 subs uh, I did get on with his gamer tags channel and I was planning on trying to get a machinima partnership there or maybe even a Yahoo's partnership uh, I wasn't really too sure but either way I'm pretty confident that I would have got it but I just I can't really say that because I didn't get it <laughs> and that channel also did get hacked and that pissed me off as well then once I got it back in active subs once again so when active subs has ruined my YouTube partnership chance throughout my YouTube career basically so if you are watching this video please Please stay an active subscriber. I will seriously appreciate that so much. And an active subs, I hate an active subs so much. Why subscribe to someone if you're too lazy to watch the videos? Uh, every every person I'm subscribed to, I do watch every single one of their videos. And even if I don't get time to watch it, I make sure to click it and like the video and comment. Tell them to come watch it. But I do definitely like the video. So if like I said, if you're watching this, and I would appreciate if you could just really stay an active subs, and that would be amazing for me because at the start of my career I did used to sponsor G Unit 123 I was the guy who got into 1000 subs that was when I had 3k and immediately started to blow up he got on Machinima and that was the time I was trying for a Machinima partnership and he got on Machinima he started to blow up and then he faked that nuke which got him subs but it earned him haters and then he just forgot about me didn't I nah, didn't speak to me again and also I did used to make graphics for Hazard Cinema F Gamers X Jaws X Jaws I made him a few backgrounds didn't talk to me again and also the moody swede made a background so basically it's big youtubers are most of them's kind of dickheads because they don't they don't really remember who made them and who really helped them out at the start like you guys who's watching my videos and i the people who's comments on my videos likes my videos and stuff and even watches my videos when i get big i seriously promise that i will go back to my older videos look at the comments and stuff and you guys will get you guys will get on a spot in my friends list and also just really any help you need because you guys were there for the start I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you and I wouldn't be enjoying YouTube if it wasn't for you so that's that's definitely the main reason I hate big YouTubers I forget all about all the people that watch their videos so like I said I'll be going back to my smaller videos if I do happen to get big and you guys will always stay on my friends list no doubt about that so don't worry about that And this gameplay, uh, I think it's the same kill streaks I'm using as yesterday. Uh, the gameplay I got in stadium, it's Spy playing Motor Team and Blackbird. 
Uh, so let me know if you guys want to see some, some more low kill streaks gameplay. I do really enjoy getting this because it's, it's less chopper gunners and stuff, which I'm sure all of you guys want to see. That's what I want to really see, to be honest, and most commentators. So let me know in the comments. The game is coming to an end, so hopefully you enjoyed it. Go check out the guy who made the instrumental at the beginning. We appreciate it a lot. And have a good day, guys, and peace.